The investigation is underway into the cause of the fire that displaced more than 100 people in an Alloway apartment complex. The blaze broke out just before noon yesterday at the Hilltop Place Apartments on Hilltop Way. Fox 11's Eric Peterson joins us now live from the scene with an update on today's investigation. Eric? Michelle, firefighters have been on the scene here for more than a day now, basically keeping an eye on what's left of this apartment complex. Now, everyone made it out of this fire safely, but for those who returned today, they say the site of this damage won't soon be forgotten. Bikes burned and a television torched. Seared reminders of a massive fire Thursday at the Hilltop Place Apartments in Alloway. Residents returned Friday to survey the damage. Briar Schultz says he was asleep at the time of the fire. It's kind of heartbreaking to see all the stuff that all of us have worked so hard and have, and now it's all gone. Rosalio Rodriguez used to live in this second floor apartment. When we saw the smoke in the hallway, yeah, then that's when we start, started thinking, hey, this could be big. His girlfriend, Erica Kabashinsky, is a nursing student. I had $1,000 um, nursing books and just all my notes and hard work that I put into that class, all my classes is gone. Crew spent Friday morning pumping water out of the basement. The fire did originate in the basement, so we do know that. We, other than that, cause-wise, we really have no idea. Three firefighters suffered minor injuries Thursday. Chief Mike Neff says all three were treated and released from the hospital. No traumatic injuries, no. It was just some overwork and, and possibly some smoke, but they'll, they'll be all right. Neff says water was tanked in to fight the fire. There was a point where we were flowing so much water that we were starting to deplete the system. And we didn't want to totally deplete the system because that then affects the people in their homes. Fire investigators are on the scene. Anything like this, you want to try to get the absolute determination of what happened. So, I mean, obviously with this much property loss, the insurance companies are going to want to know. So it, it's a big deal. So we'll, we'll work hard to figure out what happened. Meanwhile, those who lost everything say they're looking ahead. We have to start over. We, we have no other choice, you know. It's crazy. I did not think it was going to get this bad. Now the fire chief says help is already starting to roll in. Donations are being dropped off at area fire stations. As far as the damage, the chief estimates this building is a total loss. Reporting live in Alloway, Eric Peterson, Fox 11 News.